Local shopping is a big deal for many and one Topeka hub is making it more accessible just in time for big events coming up this year. 27 News reporter Gabriel Johnson is live in downtown Topeka to tell us about one district showcasing its local charm. Yeah, well, whether it's creating more space for parking, adding a fun coffee shop, or even planning for festivals, the Topeka Vendors Market is quickly making strides in its time here. It's really creating that, uh, that vibe, that district where you, know, you can go down here, you can grab a cup of coffee, you can shop unique stores, um, listen to live music, attend events. Uh, we're just really excited about what the future holds. Shopping local is what this market is all about. And with competition from large online retailers, many believe supporting small businesses has become even more important. It really is to create that ultimate customer experience. And I feel like retail, you know, has just really gotten away from that and it's too easy to shop online. We provide fun events to where you, know, you go in and you have a good time shopping. Like you, you bought something, but then on the way out, you know, it's fun to hear customers say, I want to do that again. Open Thursday through Saturday, the market offers a warm place to shop local during this cold season. Going to our, our own little shops are, it's, it's special to us because we don't like the, the big department store kind of things. We want the, the unique experience of coming to a vendor's market. And we're hoping that they'll just keep doing more of this for Topeka because we love this stuff and I know lots of other people do too. And when it warms up, you can expect the good times to also shift outside. Tacotopia, uh, we've been doing that one for the last three to four years and it's just a celebration of, of tacos. tacos. Because, yeah, <laughs> Everything taco. Who doesn't love tacos? The Kansas Chocolate Festival, the last time we did that was 2020. So we're really excited to bring that back. And if the mixed bag of boutiques and festivals wasn't enough, you'll soon be able to sip coffee from their newest edition, which continues adding to the aesthetic. We're adding a, a coffee shop and a bakery. So Adam Street Coffee and Bakery will be opening within the next month um, in the front area here. So we still have work to do uh, to get. Now, in addition to all of that, those who have been down here before know that parking can be difficult. That's why the owners tell me they are adding around 250 parking spots right here that will soon be available to the public. Working for you live in downtown Topeka, Gabriel Johnson, 27 News.